Sometimes I'm thinking that with so many cool generative AI tools and models, it's really hard to keep everything in one place. But what if there was one place with all the models in it? The creators claim Nim can replace all your subscriptions with one. But is that really true? Nim presents itself as a platform where you can access the best generative AI models all in one place. Here you can generate images, videos, and sounds, as well as restyle and upscale media files or add special effects. The platform offers dedicated tools for images, videos, and audio, along with a variety of templates. All of these models work side by side on a single platform, and we're going to see how well Nim actually performs. Let's put this generative AI aggregator to the test. Let's dive deep. I'm on Google, let's search for a name video. The website is name.video. I'm on the homepage and let's check out the UI first. Here we have the prompt input box, prompt style section, modes, story, video or image, aspect ratio and a bunch of different options for video and image generation. Let's first test the basic output and see what name can do. And then we'll explore features not listed around prompt generation field. I'm going on Twitter and I found this post about Singularity by Bindu Reddy. Let's copy that, share it with Nim and see what kind of story it will produce. And here's what we have. For generations, humanity searched for meaning, drawn to the patterns woven through the universe. Today, artificial intelligence rises not as a mere invention, but as a natural evolution. This marks the dawn of a new chapter, filled with possibility for humanity and the universe. Okay, so it looks like you can create animated stories for Instagram or TikTok here. Quick videos like that can be used for regular social media posting, even by non-professionals who just need consistent content for personal or business accounts. Let's level it up and switch to video. Take a look at the number of different models here. You can see the complexity and you can see the number of tokens that each of these will cost you. Let's actually test a few of them. The variety of models means you can always find the right result without buying another subscription. Let's switch to video. It will also add sound to the video. Let's make it 16 by nine. And let's create something funny. Make a cinematic video of a chicken dancing to a country song. Cluck, 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 yeehaw. Cluck, cluck, city life for me. Look at this. Even the lyrics and the song are relevant to the topic. It kind of looks like a commercial. Let me try to create another video with the same exact prompt and compare the two. Y'all ready for a barn dance, city slickers? Very similar, but a bit different. The sound quality is insane. Let me try to create another video with another model. Let's pick Kling for that. And this is my prompt. Woman dressed in alien clothes, Star Wars style, standing looking into the camera. And my video is being generated. Here is the video, pretty solid. Now, remember how I mentioned the models live together under one hood and they pretty much communicate with each other. So I'm going to demonstrate just that. I'm going to click on lip sync and I can now use the video generated by one model and improve it with another. I'm going to use latent sync for this one and I'm going to make her say things that I want her to say. How about this? Subscribe to Shark Numbers. I totally love this YouTube channel. Mm. This expression is totally priceless, especially the mmm part. So you got the idea. Multiple models can all work together to produce one piece of art. Let's see what other tools are in the toolbox. Let's explore the image section. Let's start with ideogram. Green looking tribe member standing in the field full of soybeans. Let's pick the highest quality and generate. All right, that was fast. Let's now turn this image into a video. Image to video and I am now going to pick one for that. Generate. All right, the video is ready and now let's click describe. Look, I just got a prompt for this video. Very interesting. Let's test the clip editor. 
Ah, okay. This is a basic video editor here for trimming. Same as before, we can upscale, add sound, lip sync, etc. We did not do sound last time. Let's do it now. Here we have the MM Audio model. This is my prompt. Sounds of wind and nature, man walking in a soybean field. And let's click generate. This is how you create documentaries from image to video to video plus audio. Pretty impressive. Let's try out something different. I'm uploading my photo. I'll pick Nana Banana model, my top one favorite. And here's my prompt. Remove hat from him, make him have a city green punk hair. All right, now we are talking, great. Now let's convert this image into a video. I'm going to pick Vio as I expect this model to make realistic footage. Man looking into the camera. Now I'm going to use Topaz and we'll upscale this video. Now I'm going to add my voice to this and... I have a serious question for you guys. Hmm... How do you like the color of my hair? Let's check out other features on NIM. How about this effect button? There are a bunch of effects that I can use to enhance my videos. The collection is rich. How about this Hulk effect? Let's check it out. For this effect, I'm going to use this picture that I generated earlier, a green version of myself, kind of relevant to the Hulk theme if you think about it. Let's click on generate and see the result. Look at these emotions. Let's explore something else. Let's click Restylize video and see what models are listed here. Here we have different animation styles. Let's pick this Chinese painting and try to convert my Hulk video into a Chinese painting. Okay, here is the result. I can of course upscale this video if I want to, looks good. Let's see what else is there on this platform. The only one that's left here is slow motion. Let's test it, generate. Okay, and you saw it all now. If we click on explore here, we can see what's been generated by others. This is a gallery in a way. If you need something for inspiration or ideas, this is a page to visit. You can also see prompts here. Definitely food for inspiration. Okay, so this is what I think. There are lots of companies that create new generative AI models. Some are great for generating cinematic videos from single prompts. Some are great at turning images into videos. Some are adding lip sync into existing videos. And some create models that change video styles. The name guys took a look at all this and said, we'll supervise all these guys. We'll put them all into one big bucket and we'll offer this bucket to people at a discounted price. We will create a so-called Costco of all generative AI models. And you know what? I think it works. It's really hard to keep track of new models and it's far easier and cheaper to just stick to one aggregator like NIM that keeps track of the market and adds new models. The token system is transparent and you can easily keep track of your usage. If you are in an industry where content generation is a part of your work, you can definitely save up here with NIM. You'll save both time and money. This tool is perfect for marketers, small business owners and those who want to start faceless channels or or monetize AI generated content. There are several plans offered and the cheapest one is $12.50 for the starter plan. You can get a major discount if you choose this plan and pay upfront for a year. If you use my referral link, you'll also receive 200 free credits to test name that video. So go ahead and check out the subscription page and details. All links are in the description. Leave your comments in the comment section. I'm done for now and I'll talk to you soon. Ivan K. TV out.